In today's YouTube video, we're gonna cover finding your hoop size and also I'm just gonna show you how to coil your hoop and make it bigger and smaller so that it's travel friendly. When you receive your hula hoop, it comes in a really cool pizza box and it's coiled which means your first step is to actually open the hula hoop and how you do that is you press the button really hard with the tip of your thumb, press it to let it pop out of the inner tubing. <laughs> you take it out and you coil it and you press the button again once it's completely open. And make sure the pop sound comes. If pop sound doesn't come, your hoop is gonna open out all the way. And once the hoop is big and you're done with your practice and everything, you can press the button again and open your hula hoop and coil it in one motion. That's essentially the goal. So if you try to coil it like, ugh, too tiring, I cannot do it. It's too hard, too much muscle. But if you do it like a dance, uh, I have no muscles, I can't do push-ups, but I can still coil a hoop, so it's great. Twin hoops! This is how you're gonna get it in your box, like that. Here you must be wondering, oh, I can't coil it. So basically, these are hoops which don't coil. These are the full sizes. These twin hoops are great if you wanna get into all kinds of double and twin hooping, which is another genre of hooping altogether. But the best part is that it is a total beginner-friendly hoop because you can pop the button for each of the hula hoops and then join it together to form a much bigger hoop size. Why I love twin hoops is because they're the most versatile hula hoop that we have at least so far because you're not just paying for one hula hoop and one hoop size but you're technically paying for three hoop sizes where you have one mini hoop and you can use it as a twin hoop combo or you can use it as a gigantic 42 inch hoop which is great for waist hooping because on body hooping is great with a big size hoop. With hula hooping, it's a very personal experience of what size works for you, what doesn't. Uh, I usually use the buying a jeans concept. When you're going out to buy a pair of denim jeans, you may be someone who's like really skinny, but maybe it is your preference to buy, you know, those boyfriend jeans, the really big baggy jeans. Even though your size would be an excess, you may feel like wanting to buy an M or a large. So the same way with the hula hoop as well, you can choose to pick a hoop that is perfectly made for your size or you can choose to pick a hoop that's more out of your personality. So I'm someone who's 5'3 in height and for me a 30 inch hoop is great but maybe someone of my height may like a 36 inch hoop and so if you DM hoop flow you get a lot of idea of what hoop size will work for what kind of hooping you want to do. I'm going to talk about the functionality of what hoop size is for what kind of hooping and maybe that will help you make your decision accordingly. So your 30 inch hoop is great for off body hoop tricks and stuff. So all the videos you see me uh, spin with in, in, on Instagram or on YouTube are all with a 30 inch hoop. And it's great for off body, but if you're an intermediate hooper or uh, really maybe tiny like I am, then a 30 inch is also very good for on body stuff. And the 36 inch hula hoop is great for on body hooping if you're a total beginner because it's big in size and so you have a bigger diameter so the hoop spins slower and that's why you get a lot more time to spin on the body. So now if you're someone that likes to just hula hoop on the waist, that's your ultimate goal, I just want a waist hoop at a party, then this is the size for you and that's why the 36 inch hoop is our best seller for a reason. And it's also one of my favorite hoops because uh, really calms you down. <laughs> also have 33 inch hoops which is not demonstrated anywhere in this YouTube video because it is out of stock in my house. <laughs> it's there online in the shop. The 33 inch hoop is for anyone who wants like the best of both worlds. Wants to do like on body but also wants to do off body then 33 is like a nice fun size. And the 42 inch hoops basically break into two parts to form two mini hoops. And two mini hoops can also be called twin hoops, which is why there's twin hooping and total beginner giant hooping for shoulder, waist, etc. all with that combo. If you're someone who's never, say, moved in your life and this is your first time picking up any kind of fitness activity or 
any kind of playful activity then this is the best size for you because it really caters to people who want to like warm into it uh, and say it's like foot in the door experience into hooping so it's very easy to spin with this these by the way are our brand new hoops in our store uh, they call holographic hoops we like to call it hollow hoops but if you take it out at night they're also called disco hoops we're the first in india selling holographic hula hoops if you go to like USA to buy this, this is six times the cost. So buy it here. <laughs> Free shipping for everyone. These are very limited in stock on our website. You can buy your hula hoop at hoopflow.com. Link is in description as well. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you next Thursday. This is my exit. Bye bye. I'm gonna tell you that I love you. 100 times a day You'll get tired of my voice That's If you uncoil it, you can skip with this as well